Hello, my beautiful Leos. Welcome to your weekly readings, re weekly energies. This is for the third week in the month of November. And speaking of this week, it's kind of like the, um, the calm before the storm. Because, you know, after this week, a lot of things starts to move because holidays are coming and as always as always take it slow for whatever it's on the way and certain things here definitely the way they need to come to you will come the way they need let's see darlings what do we have for this week what are those messages what are those insights we need to keep an eye on and how we need to proceed forward. For some of you, these messages might look like personal. For others of you, might not much speak to you. Take it accordingly. So let's see here, Leos. We have a Ten of Swords underneath and we have the Star. I do see here healing, but this healing is more like mental healing for, for whatever reason, because we do have a lot of Swords and the Star. For some of you, there's a lot of sleepless nights that happened lately. What is gonna happen? So take it, take it a little kind of slower. Be kinder to yourself. For some of you, you're taking things way more personally since we have the Queen of Cups here. Way, it's kind of way closer to your heart. For some of you, it's like the first 14 days of the month was very heavy. Probably it's a big load, mentally speaking. But now it's just kind of like, you know, take more care of you. Or give yourself more care than you usually do. It's kind of before doing other things to you. I hope you understand here but definitely I see here it's speaking of them this week might be a week when you gotta prioritize your mental health for some reason I gotta speak that way because that message is very strong and healing matters healing is necessary let's see loves Queen of uh, Queen Queen of Cups, King of Swords, Knight of Cups, Ten of Pentacles. For some of you, there is um, a family matter out there. You probably want to work it through, but you know it's going going in circles. Look at here, Queen and King of Swords. We have a tower, queen of pentacles, moon. So we have out of bad three queens. The only queen is missing, it's your queen. And for some of you, it's like whatever is going on around you, It's like it's killing your fire or your enthusiasm. For some of you, it's like you you got to find a different way to to groom you or to to protect your energy. For some of you, you consume yourself so much for whatever it's around you. And this week, as I said, you prioritize those things health related but also is about the boundaries what you give and what you don't want to give what you allow and what you don't allow all right loves for some of you could be a work family matter because some of you 
you want to bring more for your family. For example, I want to work more to buy the gifts for the holidays or I want to have a very beautiful holiday, an abundant holiday, and I need to work hard. But now you realize that is that is not a priority or can be a priority. Or that is not what you... It's like... It's not reciprocated. There's something here is not coming from every side. It's like you you fight for too much or for certain things that you you gotta kind of like slowing down about it. Whatever that speaks to you, darlings. But let's see here, what's this tower for? Knight of Pentacles. Take it easy when you love. Okay. There's something here about slow down. Somebody here may also have a conversation with someone and it's going to tell you, it's kind of like, if you're going to slow down, things will manifest better or things will show better than you even. It's kind of slow down so you can go fast. There's some something in those lines. Seven of Wands. You don't need to rush the process. Page of Pentacles. For some of you, you may also be inclined to get a second job or a second, you know, hassle venture. But you know, that will not bring you much the way you expect or the way you ask for. Yeah. I feel here you definitely have certain expectations, but Spirit says you might you might take, but might take all your time. So I see here someone definitely wants to be providing and putting the things, but Spirit says might not be the the case. What's the Ace of Wands here for? Ace of Swords. You know, quick things might not be big things. Yeah, definitely here for some of you. Gotta, gotta be easier on you or take it easier. What's the Ten of Swords here for? Page of Cups. As I said, give yourself a little soothing through seven of cups. For some of you, you're definitely looking for an extra income. Knight of Wands, like here and there, something part-time, but doesn't feel here that you 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 even can find something part-time. But now might be something that because I see here for some of you you're looking for a nighttime shift or something like that. But it might not be necessary for your for you to liken it later or might not be paid the way is expected or asked for so basically spirit says don't make quick moves into certain things because sometimes we feel like we're doing this certain things for for what don't jeopardize your health for certain material things because you'll be quite surprised how many how many people will do so for for some kind of thing that the other person when it's gifted they might not even use it as much so spirit says also focus on what really matters to you not what matters for the moment okay What else? Eight of Pentacles. Five of Wands. Death. For some of you, there's a lot of changes that are happening in a very short time. Things will get balanced. 
Definitely they will. But probably this week might be a little hectic week. But the things will get balanced or will get better. It's kind of hang in there. Yes, hang in there. For some of you, there's certain arguments between you and someone in particular. They will end. But somebody here might later on regret whatever they said. Because someone here might judge by their own things, not... It's kind of they don't put themselves in your own shoes, vice versa. So if you are saying certain things to someone or want to, be careful. Put yourself in the other person's shoes. Because someone here might later on regret whatever they say. It's kind of give a little love. Certain things definitely will change. I also see here for some Leos you... You really want to change your job or something around the job. And yes, we do have all the nights in this reading. And the nights really speaks about movement. It's happening. But again, to, to do something here rush or quick or sudden might not work for the long run. So take your time. Okay, advice for you, darlings. King of Wands. It's like you know your worth. Don't lower your value or values for little bites. Queen of Wands. The Hierophant. For some of you, is the person who you are with. Certain decisions here regards your um, your connection or your marriage or your commitment. And some of you, you will realize here. I also have a very specific message for a couple here. If you are with someone and your connection, it's pretty cold now due to, you know, the routine, probably other things got in the way. It's a good week to reconnect and also probably to plan um, a vacation or something kind of get away of the routine or get away from the the day-to-day -day things. It's kind of reconnection because things got kind of like basic or got cold and to get in a better use it's kind of either you you do this for this connection or something here it's about to to be distance so connect with each other loves this is just a specific energy for someone for some of you there is some some things here that needs to change between you and your certain plans gotta be done between you and the person you are. No place like home. To be fair, I also see here someone here will change certain things around the house or around where you live. For others of you, you might wanna Put your house on market and buy something cozier. I feel here there's certain things here that also speaks. Don't bring work home or whatever you do in your daily work related business. Don't bring it home because home is um, a place where you come and it's your sanctuary. So don't use a sanctuary to bring others things. Clean it up. For some of you, definitely here, there's certain um, things you will uh, kind of try to let it go. Think. Some, some changes around your home. 
and for some of you around the connection you are something here also speaks that things are not gonna go the way they are for too long either it's a hectic life either it's a very frugal life certain things here needs to get in balance or get better or improve and I feel here this is kind of mutual energy whatever that speaks to you darlings take it accordingly and of course you have a lovely week ahead bye for now